Vasily Lomachenko took a final step toward a clash with undisputed lightweight champion Devin Haney tonight, winning a tough fight with Jermaine Ortiz, which was meant to be the final hurdle. With both Haney, 29-0, 15 KO, and Lomachenko, 17-2, 11 KO, under top-ranked contract, it's the biggest fight available for either, and really is the biggest fight available at 135 pounds right now, at least that can actually possibly be made, since Gervonta Davis, arguably a bigger star than either, won't be fighting either one of them next. The two shared the ring after, with Haney saying he's ready for the fight, and Lomachenko saying again that he's ready to do whatever needs to be done to make the fight. He has said repeatedly that Haney is, indeed, the A-side, and that he needs the fight more than Haney does right now. Haney added on Twitter that the fight will be next if it makes sense, and one figures it will, since it's an easy-to-make, in-house fight. Haney also called the 117-111 Lomachenko card in Saturday's fight outrageous, and agreed with Shakur Stevenson that a fight between the two of them is the big one, to which he attached the bag of money emoji. In theory, Top Rank could also do Haney vs. Stevenson instead of Haney vs. Lomachenko, but the plan has clearly been to set up Haney vs. Lomachenko. Devin just fought on October 15, beating George Cambosos Jr. a second time, and the timing and everything else lines up for the Lomachenko fight. As for when that might happen, the spring of 2023 would be a good guess, somewhere between March and May.